Today we're introducing our Allen Bradley PLC control system on our HC machines. Uh, this happens to be on our HC120 machine and it, it's the state of the art as far as uh, programming and all the technology moving into the 21st century. This is the PLC based version of this device. Uh, the PLC controls and monitors the entire system. It runs the, the drive to say how fast the RPM, what it's turning. Um, it monitors any alarm. If a door is open, it helps assist the operator in controls. It's very simple and very clean compared to the other control stations which had a lot of buttons and can be overwhelming. This is very uh, clean and simple. The advantages of this control station is that it has recipes and you can store a recipe and make it very simple for any operator just to load a recipe and which has all the set speeds and times that they want the parts to be uh, in the machine. In the old machines it was all push button and, and everybody would, could set the uh, timer, they could set the speed, therefore they would cause some errors, especially uh, in the field of medical and or aerospace, you, you have to dial it in exactly to the right speed, the right time. Especially in fixtured parts that are fixtured inside the machine, some people like to run it forward and reverse. This will automatically do that and it'll take that guesswork out. Did you run it five minutes this way, five minutes that way? It'll automatically uh, run it forward and reverse if you uh, have that in that program. This will help you eliminate downtime. A big problem in the, in the world today, if something goes out or a problem occurs, what is the problem? Well, this is a smart device and will tell you if there's a fault code on the drive, uh, it was over, on, over amperage. You, the fault code will be displayed and you can, the operator can look at that or a maintenance person at that point would come in. Without having to open up the panel um, and expose himself to live voltage, uh, it's all right on the display. Basically, uh, we're moving in from the analog into the digital world now. 